This morning, the federal government is investing in infrastructure in the Metro East. U.S. Transportation Secretary uh, Pete Buttigieg is coming to Illinois with plans to improve public transportation. Our Sydney Stallworth is live in Fairview Heights with more on his visit and a big announcement. Sydney. Well, Rennie Michelle, that's exactly right. A new plan to invest in infrastructure and funding from the federal government to get it done. That's what we expect to hear from U.S. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg later on today. Now, he's going to be making three stops in Illinois, and at his last stop in the Metro East, we're going to hear about some plans to improve Metrolink. So that's going to happen around 515 this evening. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg, Senator Dick Durbin, and Congresswoman that's Nikki Budzinski will be yeah. in East St. Louis. Local leaders will take them on a tour of Metrolink light rail management facilities and then that'll be followed by a news conference to announce new funding for Metrolink in the greater St. Louis area. Buttigieg is also making stops in Savoy, Illinois to speak about a $22.6 million grant from President Biden's bipartisan infrastructure law and at the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign. He's going to talk with students there and community members about the future of transportation infrastructure and then some jobs that are available in the industry. Now, if you're wondering, we don't have exact details on what this funding is going to change. We don't know if it's going toward technology improvements or maybe even security improvements, but our crew is going to be there tonight to ask those questions and get those answers for you. And we do have to note that this funding and this new plan is coming just about one week after the deadly Metrolink shooting that we saw. We brought to you as breaking news about a week ago on board a Metrolink train. Reporting in Fairview Heights, I'm Sydney Stallworth. Five on your side.